So hello everybody, my name is Jim Life and welcome back for some more The Walking Dead Season 2. Right, so we were following Jane. Oh my god, is this seriously my pace? Oh, there's Jane. All the way over there. Well, you can auto walk from here. Oh, thank god it does it early. What's she doing? Oh, hey. Um. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. It's just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Oh, I don't want to say, um, um... Did you find anything out here? Huh? Oh, uh, not yet. I hadn't really started looking until you showed up. I didn't want to question the partner thing because she I hope really this place is what we're looking for. Really happy about it. God knows we could use a break. I think she really misses her sister. That's the thing. And it was a younger sister too, so Clementine fills the role quite well. Check this out. This gate's still locked. Which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know? Uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand for this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Find something bigger. Bigger? You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. Oh. They fill them with cement, so they're safe. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I think I almost had it. Keep looking. There's nothing else to look at. Try the other telescope, see if this one works. Oh, this one works. Are we going to spot something? There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane! There's someone coming toward us. Who is that? Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. They're limping. And who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around. Should we run for it? Normally I would, but it's too much of a risk. We can't lead him to the others. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. Oh, he's gonna open the thing. No, he's not. Nah. Go on then, let's have a talk. Hey. Oh god. Don't hurt me, I'm just a kid. I'm just a kid. Please, don't hurt me. Who are you? 
I'm Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Little girl. Jane, he has a gun. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to we you. We just need to make sure. Painkillers. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. This medicine is all she has. Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends. In the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No! You are not nice people! You have already left me defenseless, and now you... You take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey! We've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it! Clementine, we need People that stuff! People are suffering just as much as yours! You are not ah. special! Clementine, yes, you must believe We don't believe, believe a me. fucking word about your sick sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough! Oh, yeah? Well, mm. I think you're just some junkie. You know what that Take word means, huh? Oh, no, I, I think we're gonna truth. do the honest thing. Swear upon gonna my return. Own I don't believe any of this. Medicine, Clem... You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. <laughs> so what are you doing, Jane? No, oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Jane, don't do it. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. I can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? You were gonna shoot him. Why? Did you want me to? Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. Shouldn't you be with Rebecca? No, no. Kenny's way more help with Rebecca than I could be. I'm just making sure we keep track of where everyone is. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm never quite sure if she just done like people, or just plain out done like me. I'm still not sure what to think about her. She's strong, and she's been helping us, but she's cold. Maybe, but nobody's that cold. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to branch out. What do you mean? Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But... When I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. 
at least started as a good guy. But I just think he's had to take more than he can handle. Are you any better? Is anyone? Whoa, whoa, hold on. I, I didn't mean... I just want to survive. And that means picking the right sides. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you. You're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby. Back at Carver's. In the office. He stayed behind to stop the people chasing us. He died to keep us safe. Jesus. Of course. Of course he did. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's going to be a girl. Oh, yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ah, oh shit. I got this. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust them, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on them. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Oh, alrighty. And Bonnie. What were they doing? They've been busy. Hey, Clem. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? Well, it's just a, a feeling. Yeah. She's trying to get the place we found ready for Rebecca. Well, that's good. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty-handed. What? I just want to help. Oh my god. What coat? Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Maybe I could give it to Rebecca. That's a good idea. I'm sure she'll really appreciate it. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. You finally opened your eyes about Carver and what a bad person he was. That's something. Yeah. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but, uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh... We can't put Rebecca in a confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. <laughs> Any luck? No, not so much. Unless Welcome you want some broken up. glass. Oh. Is that water? Over here.
Water. Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, or I'll I go mean, ahead. Maybe. All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Mike will carry those things out. Might be a bit heavy for you. Right. You think? It probably weighs more than Clementine. I'm stuck. Oh dear. Okay. Maybe I push from oh God. Happened. Hmm. Thanks, Mike. Yeah. No problem. I'm so sorry about that, Clementine. We should have been more careful. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Go on, Clementine. Lift it. <laughs> Hey, I got this. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, it's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. We're gonna have to be conservative as hell. We'll make a plan. Everyone will have enough. I hope so. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Oh, you found something, Come buddy? Come on, stick close. <gasps> I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. So we can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. I... Not like... I mean, <laughs> just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Uh. Where is it? We'll do a pincer maneuver. I think it went over there. There he is! He's coming your way! Block him! This rocket. Oh! Oh! Sh no! Shoot. Dang it! Not with the walkers out there. Oh no! She has babies! I'm even hungrier than I was before. How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well... I'm sort of glad it got away. It had a family. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. I could do this all day. <laughs> shit, shit! Oh god! Breathe like I told you. Okay, 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 okay. Uh -oh. oh god. Oh god. Oh. Shit, walkers. How'd they get that close without anyone seeing them? The hell's Luke? Kenny, we've gotta do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. Clementine, where's the place you and Jane found? I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. Um, oh God, there's so many. We uh, gotta get out of here. Mike, help Kenny. On it. Oh, I don't know. That might have been a bad decision. Jesus. This is 
gonna be one ahead of us. I don't think he's okay. He's losing it. I mean, that... that is... It. He's doing it to protect us. Sure, but... I think you got it, Kenny. Kenny! Come on, man. Let's go! I've felt in a long time. I almost forgot what. Clementine! J Jesus, Clem, it's just not. Uh, we were just. What's going on? Well, uh. I know exactly I what's mean, going on. In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Ken. The walkers are right behind us. We have to keep them from getting up here. There's still the stairs. No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right Shit. over here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. We should. You want to help. Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. Shit, that's a lot of them. We need everyone out here. I'm going outside. I'll help pull them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come. Here. We can't let them up here. We just use a knife. There's no waste. Of okay, fine. Game loaded. Push. Oh shit. They're climbing up. What? They're gonna make it up here. Fuck! Does this shit ever end? Uh can we drop something else on them? Nothing that will stop them. Maybe we can drop the whole deck. She's right. She's right. Drop the whole deck. Drop the... Are you fucking crazy? How are we gonna do that? I don't know. Just look around. Uh, I'll try and bolt first. Look! That'll work. We bust that, the whole thing comes down. Boost me. This is only going to end badly. Clementine! Move it! Come on! I'm going as fast as I can! Watch it! Son of a bitch! Oh, that worked out perfect.
Is, is it? Oh, oh, oh! Thank God. Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? What is a boy? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? You are. That's right. You are. He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. He does, actually. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem. Why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? <laughs> Do you want to hold him? Uh, I don't know how. I don't know how. It's easy. Just keep him close and support his head. Shh, shh. There you go. You're a natural. Look at you, like a big sister. <laughs> Here, let me take him. You both should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Oh, about two years ago. I'm fine. Plus, somebody's got to watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. What do you mean you got to go? Go? Go where? Just away, okay? You know, Jamie, Thera. Fine. No, no, no. I'm not going to stick around and watch it happen to you two. You know the score. You're a smart kid. I'll be okay. Sure. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. And when push comes to shove, you'll see. I owe these people everything. They've kept me safe, looked out for me. I wouldn't be here without them. Well, they can't keep you safe forever. No one is safe forever. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. The nail fall. Versatility is not overrated. Thanks. Yeah. I, uh... I gotta go. You'd be asleep by now. You okay? Hmm. 
No, I'm not. No. I guess we all got stuff on our minds. <sighs> Temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. See if we can find some place to scavenge. Jane's gone. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit. Childish? God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just... Lay off! No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two could roll around like fucking teenagers! Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? Kenny's just trying to protect the group. Well, coming down on me isn't helping. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit! So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit Kenny, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. Whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And won't help the rest of us. And what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Kenny's right. We should leave in the morning. Rebecca is not in any condition to travel. I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to risk it. <sighs> okay, fine, if that's what you want. Look, we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. Don't look at me like that, Luke. <laughs> she is not doing so good. Sorry. Okay, Bex. It's gonna be all right. She's exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. Oh my god, she does not look well. Oh my. I think it's a little more than exhaustion. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This look like someplace warm to you? We can still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. Keeping people alive. Kenny's right. We have to keep going. Yeah, I guess. Of course, I'd expect you to say that, seeing as how you agreed with him last night. Oh, Luke, shut up. Uh, uh. Oh, here. There's a place to sit. Rebecca, let me take the baby. Oh. 
He's okay. I've got him. No. You rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being Shh. weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. And not just right now. Kenny knows what he's doing. He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. Hello? What is this? Is it that guy from before? Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please! He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. <sighs> All right. Hello. Your name is Clementine, yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. How is your sister doing? Sister? Not so good. I need, uh, uh things for bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Fuck! You kidding me? Это они? Да. Это они. Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что вы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? Чтобы у них не было. Может быть, у них есть... We don't want any trouble. I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you? you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on now. What the hell? Why get excited? Clementine, you robbed this guy? No, you aren't taking anything from us. They are not telling you to ask. So what is Josh? I wish we could have met differently, Clementine. You were kind. That is not common. Watch it, Ever. This could be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass! Слушай, Arvo, почему они не... We have a baby! You have a baby with you? У них грудничковый ребенок. Если ты знаешь, что хорошо для тебя, просто вези оружие сейчас. И слишком много. Пурико, отдай. Drop that now, or I'm gonna fucking shoot it. I'll do it. Drop it. Drop it. Don't fucking don't move. I said don't move. Ты хочешь умереть? Слими меня. No! Oh my god, that was a confusing one. Right, quick run through. Left Sarah at the trailer park. I didn't mean to leave her. I was trying to take her with me, but it, I ran out of time, I think. So I'm surprised that a lot of people left her. Hmm. Robbed Arvo. Um, I just thought it would be kind. You know, like, I know we're in an apocalypse and everything, but you don't just rob people. It's just wrong. But clearly, I should have. Uh, crawl through the ticket booth. You see, I like, as I was crawling through, I was thinking, wait, there could be a walker in there. And I was like, eh, 
already done. Um, held the baby. I mean, why not? You know, Clementine. She's clearly a natural, so why not shoot Rebecca? You see, I didn't want to shoot her in case people thought that I shot her when she was alive. I, I did not expect Kenny just to turn around and just shoot her. So, I would have shot her, but it was from the fear of some backlash. But now I think Kenny's going to get backlash in the next episode. Well, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching another episode of The Walking Dead. If you liked it, hit the like button, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and as always, I'll see you all next time. Thank <laughs> you.